Kaspar Ruud sided with Novak Djokovic as he talked up a potential ATP Finals clash. Kaspar Ruud has weighed in on the debate between who is currently the best player between inform Novak Djokovic and world number one Carlos Alcaraz as he talked up a potential ATP Finals clash with the Serb. And the world number four appeared to side with Andy Roddick as he admitted he would let Djokovic play for his life while applauding the 35-year-old's ability on indoor hard courts. Rude and Djokovic were the first men through to the semi-finals at the ATP Finals as they became the winners of their respective round-robin groups after clinching victory in their first two matches of the week. It means they can only face off in the final if they both make it there, but the 23-year-old already knows it will be a big ask to try and defeat the world number 8 in turn if they do meet. While piling praise on the five-time former champion at the ATP Finals. Rude waded into the debate on who was the better player between Djokovic and current world number one Alcaraz and admitted that he thought the Serb was the best player in the world when it came to indoor hard court tournaments. His comments came after retired pro Roddick admitted that Djokovic was still a greater player despite the current rankings. Tennis wise, I think on this surface, he's the best player in the world. Rude said after losing his first match of the week to Rafael Nadal on Thursday. Like I said maybe earlier days as well, no offense to Carlos because he has the number one spot and will end the year number one, but if we have to pick one on indoor hard court, depending on your life, I would choose Novak to play the set or match to win it, if it was depending on your life. The third seed's verdict came after seeing Djokovic in action during his 6-4, 6-1 group match win over Andrei Rublev. And Rude thought that 21-time Grand Slam champion was an even bigger favorite because of his lack of tournaments this year. The Norwegian explained, I watched a little bit against Rublev. It was yesterday. It looked like he played phenomenal. I mean, seems like he's in a great place, both physically and mentally.